Hi, welcome to Feel Korean TV Math Corner. In this video, I will show to you how to divide fraction and mixed number by a whole number. So let's start with this problem. To solve this problem, we need to follow the steps in dividing fraction by a whole number. This is another way of dividing fraction by a whole number in which we don't need to get the reciprocal of the divisor. So this is a shortcut method or a shorter method of dividing fraction by a whole number. Okay, let's answer. Just copy the numerator 8 and then multiply the denominator 9 by the whole number 2. Okay, write the whole number 8. Then 9 times 2 equals 18. Next step, reduce the fraction to lowest term. So the fraction 8 8 tenths can be reduced to lowest term. We will divide the numerator 8 and the denominator 18 by their GCF. The GCF of 8 and 18 is 2. So 8 divided by 2 equals 4 and 18 divided by 2 equals 9. The answer is 4 ninths. Another problem, 2 fifths divided by 6. Let's answer. Copy the numerator 2. Then, multiply the denominator 5 by the whole number 6. Okay, write the numerator 2. Then, 5 times 6 equals 30. Next step, reduce the fraction to lowest term. So, the answer 2 30 can be reduced to lowest term. So, we will divide the numerator and the denominator by their GCF. The GCF of 2 and 30 is 2. Okay, divide. 2 divided by 2 equals 1. 30 divided by 2 equals 15. The answer is 1 15th. This time, we will divide mixed number by a whole number. So first step, change the mixed number into improper fraction. So to do that, we will multiply the denominator and the whole number and then add the numerator to get the new numerator. So 3 times 6 equals 18 plus 2 equals 20. So 20 is the new numerator. Then copy the denominator 3. Okay, the dividend is improper fraction now. Next step, copy the numerator 20 and multiply the denominator 3 by the whole number 4. Let's multiply. 3 times 4 equals 12. So the answer is 20 over 12. It is an improper fraction, so we need to simplify it. We will divide the numerator 20 by the denominator 12. So 20 divided by 12, the answer is 1. And the remainder is 8. So the quotient 1 is the whole number. And the remainder 8 is the numerator and the divisor 12 is the denominator. The answer now is 1 and 8 twelfths. But look at the fraction, 8 twelfths. 8 and 12 have common factors. So we can reduce this fraction to lowest term. We need to divide the numerator 8 and the denominator 12 by their GCF. The GCF of 8 and 12 is 4. Okay, so let's divide. Write the whole number 1. Then divide 8 divided by 4 equals 2. 12 divided by 4 equals 3. The final answer is 1 and 2 thirds. 